Sometimes people are different. Some people are different if they are black or women or people with learning disabilities. It's not about the disability, it's about the person, really. All the King's Falls is an episodic documentary that explores disability and diversity in Tudor times and compares it to the way people respond to disability today. I actually was born with a disability back in 1970. As I got older, I was more inquisitive and wanted to find out how actually disabled people were treated in the past because the past informs us on why we're treated the way we are today. With um, disabilities, it's been on the back burner of most historians' radars for a very long time. Also, I think that um, disability history is um, not written about because history is written by the victors. They will not necessarily look at people who were on the sidelines. I am sat in front of a very well-known painting of the family of Henry VIII, which was painted in 1545 in the style of Holbein. There were two unknown people stood under some arches in that portrait. And it got me thinking, well, who are they? Why are these people there? And they're not Henry VIII's direct family, but they're actually two disabled people from the Tudor court. You've got to be close with a family to, to, to be painted into a family portrait. That's not just being a servant. Jane was actually an unsung hero. If I was Jane in her position, she wants to get her offence. I'd like to see that happen. I think Jane needs to be real, like a human being, but we have to make her 3D, because she's near in history. There is an account of Jane Fall actually shouting at the onlookers and the crowds, saying, take your caps off. Why aren't you shouting, God save the Queen? But she didn't get told off for it. She didn't get reprimanded. She didn't get sent away from the court. We know an awful lot about Will Summers. He's been written about before. There's other portraits of Will with Henry VIII. What's going on with Will? Why is he so important? And then you get to realise that they were companions. They weren't um, jesters. I don't think Will was that much of a fool because Henry used to listen to him and take advice from him. What power is that? You don't give a fool that kind of power. Out of all of them, he lasted a long time. People with Down syndrome are very, very outspoken. They'll say exactly what's on their mind, which is probably why Jane and Will were so close to the monarchs because they wouldn't think about what they were saying, they'd just come out with it. I think that when we give voice to this and life to this, you, you empower people who are disempowered by default. It's not that society is negative or bad or anything like that. It's just that when you have a specific voice that's being heard above the rest for generations, <laughs> it naturally disempowers other people. It's a very close subject to my heart. And I'm so, so, so pleased that we're actually doing this now. We're doing it. I think it's wonderful. I can't wait, I can't wait to see, to see it. Follow all the King's Falls, click and subscribe and stay tuned for our next episode.